This summer at Crossroads Repertory Theater at Indiana State, you'll be treated to the original slapstick, The Servant of Two Masters. This classic Italian comedy is a fast-paced romp featuring masked characters and hilarious plot twists and turns. Can Truffaldino really serve two masters at once and ever get a meal for himself? Oh, will two pairs of star-crossed lovers ever find their way back to one another? Find out at ISU's new theater. Get ticket information at crossroadsrep.com. Hi, I am Samantha Hayes, and I am playing the gondolier slash singing waitress. I think just being involved in this show as an actor is the most rewarding part for me, and being able to work alongside people who obviously have a lot more experience than I do since I'm just a student. And it's just been so fun for me to be introduced the, to the Commedia dell'Art because I've never worked with that before, and just being around the masks and seeing how the actors using the mask really transform into different people. That's been really fun for me to observe and learn from. My name is Ashley Wolf, and I play Clarice in The Servant of Two Masters. The, the process of creating the character of Clarice, um, that was kind of a great undertaking just because you're, you're sharing the stage with all these people that are in masks and you know they're playing to these, these great facial expressions that they already have and um, it's, it's a little tricky but you also have to pull yourself and bring yourself up to that same level and bring that same energy um, but you also want to remain grounded in true feelings and, and, and honesty which is most important so it's, it was a challenge but definitely um, really fun. My name is Ariana Cohen and I play Smeraldina in The Servant of Two Masters. I've been, it's been uh, more than a year and a half since I graduated from Indiana State University and when I first started working at Crossroads I was a freshman and a sophomore so I, since then I've moved to Chicago and I've had outside experience and it's I'm taking all that experience from Indiana State and Chicago and bringing it back here. Hi, I'm Brandon Wentz, and I play the part of Truffle Dino. I really enjoy the experience of working with masks uh, because the masks actually tell you information about the character. Uh, we put on the masks, we look in the mirror, and they tell us a lot of stuff. And it also gives you the opportunity to, sometimes in rehearsal and shows, you see people do really big, silly, goofy things, and the mask actually helps that because it's kind of a little bit of a cheating shield. Um, so you'll see us do these big, crazy, energetic things that without the mask uh, might seem a little weird. You know, we play at the mask level, not below it, because the mask has a very large expression so our bodies match that. Hello, my name is Arthur Feinsod. I'm the artistic director of Crossroads Repertory Theater and the director of The Servant of Two Masters by Carlo Galdoni. Uh, first of all, I'd like to welcome you to the uh, new theater uh, to see The Servant of Two Masters. Um, and uh, it's uh, a, a beautiful show. It was written in the 18th century um, at a time of transition historically. And it's a, a looking back at a great tradition that goes back to 1550, the Commedia dell'arte, figures that are very well known in the Commedia uh, tradition, such as Pantalone and Arlecchino and Il Dottore. There are those characters in this play, and they are with masks so it's a very unusual play for modern audiences because some of the characters are masked and other characters are not masked the lovers are not masked the women are not masked but the uh, the servants and masters are masked I've always loved this piece, and uh, many years ago I was the dramaturg in a production at Hartford Stage Company uh, under Bartlett Scher, and he was uh, quite a brilliant director. It was a very inspiring production, though our production looks very different and has very different aspects than, than Bart's production did back then. But it's, uh, it's an exciting show, and I knew it would make uh, an exciting summer show. <laughs>